Hi, my name is Clinton, and today I'm going to share with you a game called Hands Down, put out by Ideal in 1964, and you can play it at a cross the board game cafe. It is a game of quick reflexes, anticipation, psyching people out, and it features the amazing Slamomatic. You play it by everyone getting a hand of four cards. The cards are numbers, I think it's one through 11. And what you're going to do is try and score points by getting pairs. Now it's not enough to just get a pair in your hand, you have to get the pair out on the table. And to do that, you have to be really quick in hitting your little hand here. How it works is on my turn, I'm gonna have this hand, and I'm going to draw a card from the deck. If it yields a pair, which in this case it does, a pair of tens, I'm gonna hit my number three really quickly, and then everyone else playing has to also push down their hands. If you're the last one to push down, in this case number one was, you pay a penalty. And that is, you take a card from your hand and you must give it to me. In my case, now that I hit the hand, I turn in these and they become my points for the end of the game. And then I get to take that card from player one. In this case, it's a four and I have another pair, which means I can quickly do this again. There will be another person who pays a penalty to me. If I get a pair, I can go again and so on and so forth. Now, the thing is, if I drew a card and it wasn't a pair, I could still pretend I have a pair and go like this. And maybe the other players are going to react and inadvertently touch their hands, which is bad because then they pay a penalty to me anyway of one card for everyone who touches a hand. If I inadvertently do this and then I realize I don't have a hand, well, I pay a penalty and lose a card because I did this without actually having a pair. You keep playing until the cards are done and the person with the most points in front of them at the end wins. It's really good, it's really fun, it's really loud, and uh, it causes a lot of arguments.